triplets and, of course, Easter rabbits. Lord Mountbatten of Burma was accompanied by his wife during his recent official visit to Rangoon. Together, they went to the Shui Dagon Pagoda, that famous golden temple founded about 600 BC and still today the center of Buddhist devotion. Inside, they lift the sacred stone. If it seems light, your prayers will be successful. If it feels heavy, your prayers are unlikely to be answered. The main object of Lord Mountbatten's visit was to present to Burma, on behalf of the King and the Government of India, first the silver carpet woven by the wife of King Thibor, the last King of Burma. Also, the tacta poche, or royal table, that once belonged to Thibor. And chief among these historic relics, King Thibor's throne, which had now been brought back from the Calcutta Museum. From Burma, Lord and Lady Mountbatten went to Assam, where they met representatives of the Hill tribesmen, many of whom had fought under his command in the Burma campaign. A special demonstration of traditional tribal dancing was given. We may be sure the distinguished and popular visitors fully appreciated these performances by tribesmen from the hills and their womenfolk. As for the presents which were loaded upon the Earl and Countess, these were undoubtedly sincere tributes of loyalty towards the former Supreme Commander and his wife. At Lake Success, 